I am Dr. Kodladi Surendra Shetty, practicing ortho spine surgeon, based at Spine Care and Ortho Care Hospital, Magdi Road, Rajajinagar, Bangalore. Low back pain is usually caused because of the degenerated disc. So the disc is nothing but a soft structure in between the vertebral bones. So when this gets degenerated, degenerated in the sense it becomes aged or it becomes weakened. So when it gets degenerated, it collapses. The disc which is supposed to carry a lot of weight, the whole body weight is sitting on the disc. So in a healthy condition, disc will be like this. It will be carrying the full weight of the body. But when it degenerates, when it becomes weakened, it collapses it collapses, it sinks. So when it collapses, the vertical dimension of the disc decreases. Vertic when the vertical dimension of the disc, disc decreases, the horizontal dimension increases. So horizontal dimension when it increases, it stretches the outer layer of the disc. Like this, there will be outer layer of the disc, it stretches the outer layer of the disc. So outer layer of the disc is innervated, it has got nerve supply. So they get stretched, these small fine nerve endings, they get stretched. When they get stretched, people experience pain. So usually what happens is, when the patient sits for some time, maybe for 5 minutes or uh, uh, 10 minutes, he may not experience the pain. But when he sits for a longer time, maybe 15 minutes, 30 minutes or one hour. So he starts experiencing pain. And this pain gradually increases to a level that he cannot no longer sit. He, he has to stand and walk for some time to relieve the pain. This is called sitting intolerance. This is a pathognomonic feature of lower back disc problem. So sitting intolerance because he cannot sit for longer time. So usually it is because of the degenerated disc but sometimes it may be because of the structural problem like there is a break in the bone supporting of the lower back discs or it may be because of some infection or some arthritis. Spondylarthritis is very common like arthritis of the lower back what we call as ankylosing spondylitis. That reason also it can be, it can produce lower back pain.